Hello everyone and welcome to Van Tech Corner. This is an actual Wi-Fi performance test for the Geo's iNet Battle AX with the Samsung at 10. For this test, I will be using the Open Speed Test application. It is running on the one side, so the test can be considered a one-to-line Wi-Fi throughput test. The test will be done with a 5GHz Wi-Fi only. Now, the phone is connected and we have the link speed of 1.2 gigabit per second. However, this is not the highest link speed of the Barrel AX. You can check out the previous video where I get up to 2 gigabit per second Wi-Fi throughput with the PC and the Intel's AX210 module. I will start with the phone around 2 meters away from the AP. The download speed is 937 Mbps. Now, I'm at the first floor and I will walk upstairs. We are now at the second floor and the phone is still in a visible light to the barrel AX. Let's run the test again. Very good, we are having 800 Mbps throughput and it is actually the download speed. I will continue to walk through the hall. Now, we are around 5 meters away from the AP and there is a thick layer of concrete between the phone and the AP. Let's run the test again. It is interesting to see that the throughput is still not bad, it is around 200 Mbps. Lastly, let me walk to the end of the floor and run the test again. Okay, at this position, the Wi-Fi signal is very quick and we only have around 700 Mbps throughput with the 5GHz Wi-Fi. I forgot to run the test with the 2.4GHz Wi-Fi but if I run, I believe the speed should be a little bit more better. I will walk downstairs to show you the distance we have traveled. To be honest, I was surprised to see the coverage of the 5GHz Wi-Fi on the Barrels AX. This result is better than the speed I ever got with the Flink AX1800, the Unify AC Lite and the Aruba AIP205. What do you think about the device performance? Do let me know in the comment section. So that is all for this video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.